the idea of of what it would be to sort of always be aware of yourself and sort of grow up always having to measure your words and um, you know we see all the time it becomes news when some governor's 14 year old son posts something on Facebook and and it's you're supposed to post stupid stuff on Facebook when you're 14 it's just kind of the way it is but um, so I just I thought it would be fascinating for someone who had grown up kind of learning to be not vulnerable and learning to always measure what she says and sort of and then I took that out a few steps and was like what would this do to her relationships and her friendships and and that kind of thing so it was I think it was more sort of I got the inspiration from being in DC but um, I've always been fascinated by politicians children I think it's sort of a fascinating thing of that you're part of the package but you didn't really get a say in it I had a very um, close friend group growing up in high school and um, I you know I feel like Sister to the Traveling Pants did that and there's definitely been books that have addressed that but I sort of I, I felt that missing like that experience that I'd had in high school of being part of a of a foursome um, I wanted to explore that a little bit because it's it's its own thing and what it means when you know you've known someone since you were little and they know you so well and and then the group dynamics within that um you know the two people are always better friends than the other people it was more just because of the texting in the book and the group texting especially um i just kind of felt like not in 2016 if you look at someone's phone it's not going to be just words in their texts like my mother uses emojis like it just it that felt really sort of dated and unrealistic to me to have teenagers texting back and forth and not using emojis. Um, and then I just thought it was more fun. Like I really did sort of wanted to feel like this book was, you were getting, it's like you picked up one of their phones and just got to see what it said. Um, and I feel like it sort of puts you in the character's head a little bit more. But one thing I was thinking about from the beginning was I wanted it to have a lot going on. Like I really wanted it to be about family and about friendship and about romance and all of them to be equally important and all of them to be sort of happening at the same time and driving the story. Um, because I hadn't really done that before and I, I sort of feel like that's kind of what life is, is all of life sort of happens at once, sort of at the least opportune moment. Mm -hmm.